This video is a summary video on L-carnitine. What is it? And what's the most important use of L-carnitine? It's an amino acid that transports fat into the mitochondria. The mitochondria is the energy factory in all of your cells. It produces the energy currency called ATP. And L-carnitine also will handle some of the waste that's generated from the fat that's being oxidized. Now, since its job is to transport fat into the oven, so to speak, for burning, uh, people take it to lose weight, okay? They take it to develop more energy. While they're working out, they get more endurance. They have better recovery if they're exercising. So these are the main reasons why people consume this, but there's actually a bigger reason that I'm gonna talk about. Most of your cells, okay, uh, contain between 500 and 2,000 mitochondria. But the heart cell has 5,000 mitochondria. That's incredible. That's a lot of mitochondria. Now, the interesting thing about the heart muscle that's different than the skeletal muscle is it doesn't have a glycogen reserve. And when you burn fat, most of that fat turns into free fatty acids and only 40% of it turns into ketones. So when we talk about fat burning, we're not talking about just ketones, we're also talking about fatty acids. And the heart loves fatty acids. In fact, it runs on fatty acids, it runs on other things like lactate and ketones, but it loves fatty acids. So it needs L-carnitine to transport these fatty acids into the machinery to burn for its energy. So if you have a congestive heart failure or you have some arrhythmia problem with the heart or any type of heart damage, this product is what you would want to consume. In addition to coenzyme Q10, those two are dynamite for the heart. As they age, they make less and less L-carnitine. And also as they age, they cannot digest or absorb protein as well. So protein does not turn into body tissue like it did when they were 18 years old. Not to mention the fact that um, a lot of people have low stomach acid, so they're not digesting this protein to eventually get this as well because your body makes it. So we have a protein absorption problem. We have a digestive problem, be able to break down the protein. As we age, we can't make this as well. And also, if you're not consuming the cofactors to make it, like B6, vitamin C, some of the other B vitamins, and that could be another reason why this could benefit you. But I just wanted to create this summary video to point out uh, that L-carnitine is not just for athletes, okay? Not just for people that want to lose weight. It's also, and even more importantly, for people that want to support a healthy cardiovascular system. Thanks for watching. Hey, if you're liking this content, please subscribe now and I will actually keep you updated on future videos.